So we're still touring around Penang, going from resort to resort, town to town. What do you think of everything so far, Karen? I like walking the beach. The beach is great. You can see the beach behind us. And it smells great. There's a lot of seafood, right? Oh, it's known for its seafood. And today we're going to have the ultimate seafood feast. A buffet. Yes. At the famous Shangri-La restaurant. Buffet. Buffet. So they have like a seafood dinner, it's reservations. So we made reservations ahead of time and we're going to do our best to show everybody. Yay, I'm hungry. How about oh, you? Yeah, I'm starving. So I'm looking forward to it. So make sure to like and subscribe. Comment. And ring the bell. So we're here just kind of walking around. This is the resort. See those ships out there, Karen? Oh, no, right, right. I guess we got ships or boats. Oh, yeah, those are boats. That's like some wave runners. As you can see, this is the this kind of the general. One of many. This is a very popular destination for locals and tourists because it's kind of really close to Georgetown or it's just a I can't remember what is that area that we're at northern we're northern north, Penang. Yeah it's, we're staying just north of Georgetown and it's a beautiful area. Those are the rain trees. That's a great Jesus this is a beautiful place. What do you think of this architecture in the hotel for shangri -La? Does it kind of have a Thailand feel to it or the it tips? Does. Kind it does. It almost seems like I mean, we are, we are fairly close to Thailand. Right? Right, Wind's picking up. So we're just touring around this location while we wait on a seafood feast. Those rain trees are amazing. These big trees right here. We call them beach rain trees. Oh, hey, look at the, the palms underneath oh, yeah. the rain trees. Those are the palms that, you know, you see in movies where they fan you. Oh, when you're yeah, like the old Hollywood movies. I think it was like Elizabeth Taylor and she was, what was that? Doing this movie. Cleopatra. She was playing Cleopatra and they were using those to keep her cool. That's a, that's a pretty big tree right there. They say that these trees are like, they were like saved. And we're pretty close to a, an area called Monkey Beach. So. It's huge. We are really close to Monkey Beach. We're going to get a whole video of Monkey Beach at some point. If you get a chance to come to Malaysia, obviously you got to, you know, come to Penang. You know, this is Monkey Beach, but it sure is pretty. Well, look at this. Uh, Unusual looking flower. It's a, it's really cool to see some of the like so that almost like a botanical garden. Now this tree is so big. Wow. I would be surprised if there was with several monkeys in it. There could be monkeys in it. Where do you guys hide. see our new place that's coming up in a couple of weeks? Yay. Where are we gonna be staying? We have a place to call home. Yes, our new home base is going to be in northern Penang. Oh, look at that. We're going to be living on Monkey Mountain. I think there's like a... Oh, there's a shrine over here. He's hanging out in a shrine because they're probably putting food out there. Oh, yeah. Huh. Well... See him. There it is, Where? right up there. <laughs> I saw it. I saw it fly from one branch to another. Oh, you might see him jumping. Yeah, it's a famous flying squirrel around here. Hi. Hi. So we're here at the seafood buffet. And there's lots of it. We're gonna and go check it out. Every single dish. We're gonna that show dish. you. Yeah, we're gonna show you everything we see, and then we'll let you know how some of this stuff tastes. 
I absolutely love fish. Mm, we're pretty excited. Is that a snail? It is. Are, are all of those snails? Uh, conks, sometimes they're called escargot. They're just snails. A conch is a snail? I think so. That looks like ginger green uh, style. Oh, don't they still look cute? Uh, everybody's getting their buffet ready. Oh, what's it? There's things with cocktail sauce, scallops, and mushrooms. What type of scallops do you put these on? Uh, the expensive kind. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at the oyster. Wow. That's beautiful. You know, I bet those are pretty good. That looks like they've done nothing but legs. Oh, look at the baby octopus. Ooh, yeah, those are good. And the uh, yabbies. I think we call them crawdads, but they're calling them gabbies. Oh, gabbies. Oh, gabbies. Yeah, they look like crawdads, though. We have those in other places, and they're very good. Smoked. Salmon, maybe? Different salads. They let us come in here a little early. What do you think of what you see so far, Karen? Oh, I like the baby octopus. Ooh, those look really the good. The little bitty tiny ones. How about you? Yabbies. The yabbies look really good. Soup station. Sweet corn soup today. Nuts. Together a nice display. There she is. Chicken teriyaki. As you can see, this is a huge buffet. This is the Western cuisine area. They do a really good job with this play. Hey, did you see the creamy seafood? Very good. Really good. Let's look over over here. What's over here? Oh, Indian section. Oh, look at that mango chutney and the mint sauce. That's so good. Egg, mo egg masala. This is the Indian section here. It looks like he's doing like tandoori chicken. Vegetarian sauces. Very nice. Let's see. It's kind of a Chinese, this is like the Chinese section. But this is awesome. Wow, these are nice. These are really, I love those. These are really nice, nice dishes. They got a little bit of Chinese Malaysian, what we call it. They're doing soup, chicken soup. Look at all of the different ingredients. Wow, it's very good. Just kind of pick what you want. They get it, they just get it all out for you out of this chill. Wow, this was very nice. Look over here, Terry. Your favorite. Dessert? 
my favorite. They have dessert on seafood tonight. Look at all this down here. Oh wow! Maybe we made the order of ice cream. Oh. Let's go, over nice. Let's go over here. Let's go see that silver thing. Blueberry what is crumble. That? Wow. That's so good. What does that sign say? Blueberry crumble with vanilla sauce. Ooh, that looks well, very nice. Wow, there's a lot of choices here. Very nice. Everybody else likes it too. You guys are gonna love this video. Remember, make reservations if you come over here to Shangri La in Northern Penang. This is the this is like a Saturday and Sunday only buffet, and a lot of people come out here. Kind of drink section, mixed drinks. Did you see all the fresh food? They've got dragon fruit. They've got star fruit. Yeah. Fresh pineapple. What do you think, Karen? Oh, they have cabrolet, pineapple caramel, green velvet. I think it's oh. time to start getting our food. Oh, let's eat. That was super fun. Right. So we got some great choices. I went total seafood. Oh, I The went. money plate. Yeah, that's true. Um, I'm going to go a little bit seafood all night long, taste myself. And so what's some uh, first things that you're going to try, John? Oh, so many choices. I have sushi. I have prawns, oysters, clams, some green seaweed. Oh, you have an octopus? No, and this, this is the yabbies. Yabby crawdad. Very good. This is uh, like, I'm going to try this, this, this tea they brought. They had Tartar sauce curry. Oh, that's unusual. Mmm. Not too sweet. Yeah, I try that. It's called nutmeg tea, iced tea. Mm. That's a fruit. Well, it's got nutmeg in it. Nutmeg is a fruit? <laughs> no. Mm. It's nutmeg flavored juice, I think. That's pretty good. So this is I good. liked it. You can all see that. That's that my looks initial plate. great. Show yours. Oh, you went for the, the beef. Look, yeah. Oh, you got a little bit of everything. I have actually. the uh, sea bass. Wow. And we have also the famous watermelon freshly squeezed. We love our watermelon juice. It's like very refreshing. Shall we say a prayer? Sure. Heavenly Father, thank you for this food. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. So. That looks like kimchi. It is kimchi. Really? Oh, to go along with maybe the sushi? Korean and then Japanese. Wow. International. Do. I don't have any chopsticks, so. You've got to try the sea bass. Mm. I can't even describe that orange stuff that's on top of it, but it is so good. I love this. Green seaweed. Is it really seaweed? Mm -hmm. It's really? very good. Wow. Well, this orange stuff and then this uh, sea bass that tastes really fresh. Mm. I'll wow. get some of that in there. It's hot. Mm. Up this really cool looking oyster. That looks good. Are you gonna eat it all at once? Oh, you gotta, you gotta uh, drink the juice too. Just water, not juice. How was it? Did it just flow down your throat? Yeah, I mean, it's not super slimy or anything. Let's try the mussel. Mussels cooked. Oh. So I think the clam is too. Does it taste fresh? 
Everything tastes fresh. Tiki masala. Hmm. Indian. Oh yeah. I think the wasabi. I say that, but watch now it'd be too hot, but it seems a little on the weak side. Mmm. Oh really? You got some wasabi? Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a wasabi on top of this sushi. I'm gonna have some wasabi. Are you gonna the have octopus. one of those baby octopus? Wow. Mm. It's not very Isn't that healthy. Cute? I don't know if they would agree with being cute hmm. as the ghost tends to my tummy. I'm going to try a sushi. Have you tried this sushi yet? I didn't get that one. You didn't? No. That is, but it's very good. It's got wasabi right on it. This watermelon juice inside the restaurant. Mm -hmm. We're at the Spice Cafe and uh, stand this resort, Shangri La. Oh, yeah, Shangri La North Resort. Let's see, let's see here. Spice Cafe, it's called the Spice Cafe, and we had to have reservations ahead of time. It's kind of a reservation only seafood buffet that they only do on the weekends. Oh, yeah, Friday and Saturday. Yeah, it's just a weekend thing. You know, they have an international night on Thursday. This is pretty international. That's true, they do a good job on the international. They've got a Malay. Chinese section, it looks amazing as well. You know, when you taste something that's over the top, great. Oh, thank you. It's very good. It's hard to go to something else because it's over the top. Good. And the sea bass with this orange stuff Let's on see. top. This is amazing. I think I could live on it. get this sea bass orange stuff but I don't know what the orange stuff is it's kind of sweet I think that's why I, I have this little bowl over here I think maybe it's eggs mm. although I'm mangling my yabby here does it have a lot of flavor or a little bit uh, it's not super flavorful. I think I like the idea of it. Mmm. All of it. These prawns look really good. Oh, you have to try the sea bass. Oh, no. And I think I want to try one of every one of those desserts. They have a lot of desserts. I, I don't know any what I would get. Yeah, I'm gonna be so full off of prawns. Right, my fingers are getting lapa messy. I'm not gonna lie. Did you try one of these sea scallops? Yeah, I have. It's really good. Oh. And the curry tartar sauce. Wow, that's really good. And it's uh, the tartar sauce, the curry, is really good with that tiki masala. And they have lamb over there too. I think this lemon water is for my fingers. Mmm. That is very fresh. Nice. I think I'm going to try their lamb. You know, they have a lot of lamb over here in Malaysia, they which do. I like. It's exceptional too. I love this. 
That is good. So. Round two. Round two. Oh, this Pass is three. a lot of fun. And we got dessert. You haven't tried that sea bass. Maybe you can tell me what that orange stuff is on top. Isn't that good? Egg with like fish brain or something? Fish brain? Maybe. Fish brain. Could it be fish and eggs? I don't know. But it tastes good. Doesn't it? It tastes so sweet, the fish. And it's hot. That little orange stuff is hot. What'd you get? Oh, I got some more of the sea bass. I, I couldn't resist. And more of the tiki masala. And I got some mango with chutney. And some more of the, um, the curry tartar sauce. And some yogurt to go along with the tiki masala. And then uh, that one sushi that's got wasabi on top. It tastes like salmon. It's really, really good. Looks like you have a big variety. Yeah, I have some mushrooms here that are different. Where? Right here. Oh. What do they taste like? Like really good mushrooms. Really? I don't do they know. taste unique? No, not really. No? But they taste, I mean, they're good. Oh. This is a, I got the lamb too. I tried, I haven't had tried that lamb yet. Oh, the lamb is very good. Oh. You got some uh, some uh, rarer lamb underneath. Isn't this called star fruit? What? It's shaped like a star. Probably. Look at that. It's shaped like a star. That's why they call it star fruit. This is very good. Highly recommend. I, I think this is worth coming back for. Mmm. Well, this is gonna be our home base here in Penang for some time, so. We green will, apple. Uh, Tastes we'll like your green can. apple. Why don't you try some of these other these are, uh, mango stuff? Why don't you try the thing that is pink on the outside and it's got all those black dots? Oh, that's dragon fruit. Mm -hmm. So what? What does it taste like? A little sweet, a little bitter with the skim. Oh, it's good. It's oh, really? A, hey, why don't you try that star fruit and see what you think? What do you think it tastes like? I think it tastes like a green apple. Only with the consistency of like maybe a uh, orange. It's not as, it's a little, just a little tarty maybe. But it's not super sweet. The green apple part. Well, I, I think this is a good way to finish yep. the day because we're going to continue on and eat and eat. We have some eat. more to go. This is our lunch and our dinner. So, well. Thank you for coming along on our food journey. Make sure to like and subscribe. And give a comment of your favorite Malaysian dish. Absolutely. And don't forget to ring the bell. All right, travel on everyone. Cheers.